number 80, Steve Largent. <laughs> Cornelius under center this time. Off the play fake all kinds of time, throws, hit as he throws, and that causes the interception. Jeremy Clark with the pick. First turnover of the ball game for either squad. And this hometown Seattle team going crazy. That ball either has to go over to the sideline or out of bounds if he's trying to throw it away. But fortunately for Seattle's sake. Here comes the blitz. Set. Cornelius had no chance. Steve Williams again. And he's just going to come straight in, get to Cornelius. Cornelius never saw him. His eyes are on the opposite side. And he's able to get a free run on the quarterback. And again, the defense is playing well, getting pressure on these guys, not allowing them to be comfortable and get the ball down the field. F off, F left. 31 ace, shingle, find. 31 ace, right. shingle, find. Hey, 31 ace, oh, on ready. Action. Here's Silvers on third down. Caught, Reynolds moves the chains down to the 20-yard line. That one picked off. He threw it behind Hamlet and right into the arms of Tavarius McFadden, who's down the sideline with an escort and into the end zone for the touchdown. First touchdown of the season for the Vipers. What was the coverage? What did you see? Well, we finally got to play a little zone coverage where we keep our eyes on the quarterback. They threw the ball. Just broke on the ball, made a play. When did you know that was a house call? As soon as I caught the ball. Whenever the defense get the ball in their hands, there's only one mentality, go score. And what was any adjustments? You're pitching a shutout. What was the adjustments, if any, at half? Well, it wasn't really too much, too many adjustments. We just know that we got to come out here and play. They don't score, they don't win. Appreciate it. Thanks. Here's Silvers to pass. Over the middle, he's got a man wide open. Keenan Reynolds, and that's the way to answer. All the way to the house. I told coach before going to the locker room, we got to run it because they can't. We can get win inside, we can win outside. We struggled early on, but we finally connected. And you told your quarterback to just give some air, give you an opportunity. Yeah, man, we just got to keep playing. That's part of the game. I've been a quarterback, I know how it is. He kept playing, made it, he threw a dime, we got a touchdown. Good luck in that second half. Intercepted and touchdown. Wow, what a play by Marcel Fraser. Um, the crowd was getting loud. I gave him a jab step inside, came outside. The quarterback's kind of short. He threw it low and I just jumped up and got it. How quickly do you see that play happening before your eyes? I seen it and he was just dropping right into me and he threw it low and I just jumped up. Ex Milwaukee wide branch. In the slot to the top. Cornelius can't get rid of it as he is brought down for the sack. Jordan Thompson, number 99, ends that drive. Cornelius. Towards the end zone. Intercepted. Game over. Kyle Cairo finishes it off. The sports world is buzzing about the XFL. It's XFL football, man. And this week should be even better. That was gorgeous. St. Louis, Houston, tomorrow at 6 Eastern on FS1.